Uh, what's up everybody uh, this video we took a quick trip to the uh, Yosemite National Park the Glacier Point but the reason I want to show you this part is just in case you have you know a quick plan uh, like us we did not have a reservation to the park so if you don't have a reservation you can go in before 5 a.m. or after 4 p.m. So in order to do that, we wanted to stay somewhere closer. This is the south entrance via uh, uh, Vavana Road through uh, Mar Maragosa. So uh, this place is only like eight minutes from the entrance. Uh, the reason why we yeah we, that's what the reason why we wanted to go close to there because we have to get up and then uh, get in side the gate before the 5 a.m. and plus if you plan to go onto the glacier point to see the sunset I mean sunrise this is the perfect uh, spot it's a free camping area it's uh, wherever you can find your own spot and I recommend to get there maybe uh, before sunset we got there around 8 p.m. and uh, it wasn't full uh, this flat area was wide open and you know if you get there before sun sets you can see so you can maybe drive into uh, between the you know trees and camp there it might be nicer but if you like the flat area right here it's perfect so the place is called uh, goat meadow it's like the name of uh, the animal goat middle and yep just drive in and camp there and then we got up in the morning you know we got there and we made we made all we had our dinner there and then um, we got up at 4 uh, a.m. and drove into the park once you're in the park you can have all day there and just discover around so and it's um, closer to um, to the glacier point from this way so anyway uh, enjoy the video glacier point is beautiful can't wait to go back what's up everybody Bo is here today guess where we at yep you can see the half dome right here we at Yosemite national park we are up way up at the the end of glacier point we are at the glacier point right now three uh, band families coming over here and we're gonna just tour around do some hiking you know just sightseeing this is a breathtaking uh, photo right here you can see my goodness this, this is so beautiful the scenery around here just endless everywhere every angle that we go we we go so too bad today it's kind of foggy or maybe it's too much smoke in the valley so even the sun is already up there it's not as clear but that's as much as we can see it's already pretty so we're gonna go hike around and then uh, see what else uh, we can see I, I think the waterfall are dried out so we don't see the waterfalls this year and let's go discover somewhere else down the road this way actually we're going this way
All right, you guys, we were go we were gonna stop at the uh, park the trailhead parking lot over there, Taft Point. There are three spots, three parking lots, but all full, all full, nothing left. So I don't think we we're gonna have a chance to hike that. That means we have reason to come back in the future, right? But we uh, we just pull alongside the road here. It's quiet. It's just us with the nature, beautiful, silent, you know. So. We're cooking uh, lunch right now. Can't get any better than this. I mean, the weather, 65 degrees right now. It's, it's beautiful. No wind, nothing. Calm. Let's go, let's go uh, have some lunch. Lunch is being served today. It's the type of noodle. This is Cambodian dish noodle. It's a, a white rice noodle, vermicelli, and you can throw any kind of ve vegetable that you 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 like. We even have banana flower. Okay, yes, banana flower. Blossom. Banana, banana bl blossom, yeah. And all kinds of herbs, uh, cucumber. Um, what else we, uh, we have? The, the cabbage. Yes, cabbage and bean sprout, you name it. Just throw everything in there, it may, mix with your noodle. And then there's a uh, this, uh, soup. The, the broth for it, uh, the broth is made of uh, like ground meat, uh, like fish or you can do with chicken. It's really healthy and the ingredients besides the fish, there's, there's also, um, uh, what's the, the yellow thing in the turmeric? Turmeric, yes. I forgot the turmeric's name, yes. In there, that's why it makes it yellow. So let's take a look. It's it's a very healthy dish, huh? Look at that. Mm -hmm. So good, Princeton. So so good. Okay, Princeton's gonna go like three three trips, right? Okay, first we start with noodle. All right. Thank you, thank you. These, these, no, I'm kidding. Um, chop, chopped up um, uh, string beans. Okay, some herbs, I don't know what they call these, just herbs. And these are cabbages, cabbage. And banana blossom right here. Slice it really thin. And Mixed with bean sprout, we just this is a long yeah. bean, long bean, right? Long bean or yeah. string bean, long beans. Okay, there you go. Any Thank you. Else? Yeah, if you want more, I think I'm I'm good with this. Okay. Too much already, and then we just gonna yeah. Stir it up, and then just soak it. You can see. There's also peanut, roasted peanut in here. Okay, now you just stir it and serve in the jungle. Our lunch is done. Next, next stop is going to be at the entrance and it's the welcome center. And from there we are going to see if we can drive into the uh, giant sequoia uh, trees area. Forgot what that call. 
Uh, if not, let's see if the bus service is working. We're gonna go, we're gonna take the bus and just park our van at the visitor center and we can, we just take the bus. It's a free shuttle bus. We are here at the information, the visitor center to the uh, uh, Mariposa Grove. This is the giant sequoia trees uh, trail. We're gonna go see, you can see behind me here. It's gonna be a lot of big trees. Let's go see. Okay, we are going to get on the bus. <laughs> Look at this, these giant sequoias, guys. These are beautiful sequoias. We'll find, we're gonna find out how old these, these giants are. Let's go see. There's a couple of miles trail. The, these giants, okay, and within this grove here, there's one tree, there's a couple trees that can uh, be around 1800 years to 2800 years old. Can you believe that? And one of them would say 128 years old. That is giant. My God. Amazing. On our way to the grizzly giant, which is one of the best, I mean the biggest trees. We're almost there, 0 0.2 miles to go. Good job, honey. Happy that one. This is it, you guys. The giant, the grizzly giant. Grizzly and giant. We gotta see it, how big this tree is, how many thousand years old, we don't know. Let's go close up. Yeah, it's about the size of his, what, your hug? Oh, it's, oh, it's, it's yeah, it's, it's bigger. bigger than that. Let's go see. Yeah. Look at this comparison. Guys, this giant, look at this, compared to the Statue of Liberty. 209 feet or 28 feet in diameter that is that's how big this tree is we gotta go take a look closer I love that actually. Yeah. So, I mean, what's that stuff in really? It's not like the little Oh, you said it. Oh, yeah. Oh, my God. We can't chat. Bye, guys. I have to keep it from you. What? Shuttle bus runs around here. Uh, sometimes you can drive yourself in, but. I think this weekend is just too busy, so they they close the road and the bus is, shuttle bus runs for free. They drop you up here every 15 minutes. The shuttle bus arrives, and uh, it wasn't 15 minutes yet since the last one left. So the next one's already here. Let's see, looks like he's coming already. Let's go.